3D or real-time data is a Microsoft Office Excel worksheet function that can call market data and other information via an RTD server that communicates with your CQG. Through the use of these RTD formulas, you can create Excel displays that offer you more sophisticated analysis capabilities, as well as the use of Excel's data visualization features for highlighting market information. Welcome to part one of an overview of using RTD and CQG to power Excel displays. This video walks you through the basic steps of using RTD formulas and guidelines towards building Excel displays. RTD is extremely efficient and offers many advantages over dynamic data exchange formulas, otherwise known as DDE. With RTD, you can drive calculation formulas based on cells that reference real-time data. You can also request market data, historical data, and current working orders and positions data, including synthetic spreads. The basic RTD formula uses the following syntax in the formula in the Excel cell. Equal sign RTD is the Excel function. CQG.RTD call for data from the RTD server. Contract data is the type of the data called. Also available are studies data. CLE is the market symbol. Last trade is the particular market data being called. Using RTD formulas, you can substitute a reference to another cell in the formula. For example, here the symbol in the formula is using information from cell C2. RTD allows you to change symbols and the spreadsheet populates with market information based on that single cell's input. This allows you to make far more flexible spreadsheet displays. When you install or upgrade your CQG client, there are two RTD sample spreadsheets included. They are located in the samples folder in your CQG net folder. The first spreadsheet is called labels RTD. The second is called studies RTD. These two samples spreadsheets offer you the basics of using RTD formulas as well as examples of display pages. Also, you can download the two samples and learn more about RTD and Excel at the CQG website from the Market Data Group. This concludes part one of an overview of using RTD and CQG to power Excel Displays video. Thank you.